Welcome to the GE Video Academy. This video demonstrates the data key hold timeout feature available on SD firmware release 509 plus. SD radios should be operated at a baud rate, that's the serial data rate of the RTU or PLC device connected to the SD radio that is matched or higher than the rate of the selected modem, that is the over the air data rate. To overcome this constraint, the data key hold timeout feature has been implemented for use in networks that require a serial baud rate that is slower than that of the over the air rate. Increasing the data key hold timeout from its default value of two characters prevents frequent key up and key down sequences between character times. The parameter can be adjusted between the values of 1 and 10 characters. Setting the value will be determined by network performance. I'll begin by showing the performance of the network I have on the screen. This network is operating at 4800 modem speed. The baud rate is 1200. Note that while data is passing, there are data hits being taken. To use the data key hold timeout feature, open a web browser to the access point radio. Navigate to the advanced settings window by selecting configuration, then radio. Scroll down to the advanced settings window. Adjust the data key hold timeout from the default value of 2 to any value between 1 and 10. Here I am adjusting to 6 characters. Select Commit Configuration. Open a web browser to the remote radio. Navigate to the Advanced Settings window by selecting Configuration, then Radio. Scroll down to the Advanced Settings window. Adjust the data key hold timeout to match that of the access point radio. Select Commit Configuration. Note, when I restart the polling, data is now freely passing and taking no hits. The overall performance has improved. As the SD manual states, the baud rate should always be matched to the modem speed or higher, but in special circumstances where the PLC or RTU device is unable to be configured that way, adjusting the data key timeout feature will help optimize for better system performance.